Oh, God. He's so Your good boss. to see you. Hey, wild man. You getting any better? Playing games, listening to audiobooks. Yeah. Change your shirt. So we've discovered that some of his problem with pain is that his bladder gets full. His bladder gets full. And then I can't pee. The nerves. I can't pee. Did you put the catheter in? Yeah, I've had them twice. They did. They've done it twice. Oh, they have to do it again? Mama seems stressed out about it. They can't just well, leave I'm it? They can't just stressed out about it? No, they're just scared. They're going to have to do it again? Yeah, we're just going to do bed? it. You must be full, not nursing Henry. Yeah. It's 9.30. How long has it been? A 10, 12 hours. He's been pigging out. <laughs> Is he good? Is he doing okay? Uh, I miss good. him so much. You got to go see him. I saw you on your live tonight. You go, oh. And it made me miss home. Oh, yeah. Is it good, Jonah? You gotta get it in, yeah. don't you? Big Papa's feeding. <laughs> I'm going home. I've been here since 10, 15 ish, and it is, it is 9.45, so I gotta go get my car. All right. Get home before I'm I know, I gotta up. get home before anyone wakes up. Jonah has surgery at three tomorrow. So I'm going to come in the morning and then Justin will go back to the farm and then he'll come back before surgery. Jonah, you're not tired? No, I slept. Mm. Well, good night, buddy. I'm gonna be right over there if you need me. feeling this morning? Still got some pain. Do you? That's crazy. You're starting to get better and then you're going to have to go to surgery again, huh? Yeah. Grandma just texted me and said the sheep up at our house need moved. Can you go take care of that? <laughs> I wish I could. <laughs> I know. I know. You relax. You don't. I think, I think I'll be able to today. We'll see how Josiah does. Josiah's doing it all by himself, him and Lily. How do you think that'll go? Not so great. <laughs> yeah. He's been kind of stepping it up. Yeah, he can. My recovery will be longer because I'm having surgery. I know. It'll be like winter by the time I get better. They have to cut all that stitches out again, take the yeah. bandaid off. Yeah. Open up, then they have to pull my bone away from my body. Really? To pull it out, reach in with pliers or something. And pull the bone fragments out. Then I have to go in for another scan to make sure they got it all. They have to dislodge you again? They don't have to pull it out. They oh, okay, good. Pull forward. They just pull my leg down. Right. Gosh. Are you talking about that's yeah. where it is? Okay, that makes sense. And then those screws are holding So they have the to ball pull cap. that a little bit. They don't have to pull it out of the joint, you're saying. No, they just pull it down. Okay. Jonah wanted little Henry to come see him, but they gotta be 12. That's Jonah's view. You can't see, They're, it's foggy. There are some mountains, but we still got this roof. He's the first guy to ever ask for that. Proud little guy. And after surgery, they're trying to get him a better room with a better view. He's the first guy to ask to be faced towards the window. What's this? I'm supposed to get the white all the way to the green. Can you so, do it? Yeah, I just did it. That's all you gotta do? Uh, let's see. You gotta get this <laughs> ring all the way up to the top. Okay. It makes me want to cough. It's a cough really long exercise. Coughing is very uncomfortable. Mm, yeah. Because yeah. it heaves up my chest, which then yeah. provokes my... Look who's here. <laughs> He has two screws in his hip. This is his, oh, this is his hip. This is his leg bone. He's got two screws holding it in. And then look, there's bone fragments right there that have to be removed. Just have what does the motorbike look like after the wreck? Handlebars, that's it. The handlebars are jacked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you set that? Yeah. Did you move the shed? Yeah. It's a little water. 
That's okay. That's why I'm going home. <laughs> what did he we'll get the water. I'm going to the water. I forgot water once. That's why I'm going. Actually, we'll go soon. We'll let you visit Gemma yeah. a little bit, and then we'll go. Because I have to be back by three. Yeah. And we have to set up paddock the sheep up on the mountain. Yeah. Jenna, we're gonna head out with Josiah. He's gonna give you a sweater. No, he's giving it to me because I forgot oh. my sweater. I'm cold. Oh, okay. We're gonna go. We're gonna go take care of the farm, Jenna. See you, buddy. See ya. Bye, Vic. Bye. I love you. Love you too. Do they have their water, Josiah? Nope. Okay. We'll go there first. Oh, look at her. <laughs> Honey slicking stud muffin. Ah, oh, that's right. You got horse lessons. Grandma gonna take you? Mm -hmm. Okay, good deal. Gideon, did you get the eggs? Yes. Are you sure? Did he get the eggs? He did. Good job, buddy. Way to step it up. How many eggs you get? A lot. Cool. Well, I'd say they were thirsty. Good news, honey is in heat. So we're gonna have us another American Milk and Devon Jersey cross. And we'll know, we'll know that she, we weren't sure if she got bread and we wouldn't know the date. We wouldn't know when to dry her off, now we'll know. And we'll know if she got pregnant. Mark the date. This is about where it happened. Dropped his bike somewhere in here, probably on the sand. It's kind of dirt, dusty. Dirt. The motorbike accident happened, and he wasn't breaking any rules. He had his helmet on, he was doing the right thing, just, who knows? It is significantly cooler in these woods. So this thing did leak out. What do you think the problem is? Not level? Okay, let's get it downhill to where maybe we can get it more level. It's right there. Maybe right here or down there in that there. flat area. Right there. Oh, yeah, that might not be terrible. And then you have a tree. They like to tie it to a tree. Where's the brush, my man? Okay, good. And then I want you to go get the lid for this thing. Okay, you do that, I'll get the hose. Okay. Got good news, guys. I don't think it's leaking. We either had it sitting funny or it was because it was unlevel. Oh, wait, what's that? What is that? Why? It just happened. That is totally draining. Okay, so all right, let's just level it up then more. We should turn this, I guess it's like a vacuum seal-ish thing. Ready? One, two, three. That's that a little worked. Bit too high. Well, I think. Oh, why? Look, it's like maybe higher. Yeah, oh, higher this side a little bit. It's probably an air intake, and it probably needs to be higher. Higher. It's like on a vacuum seal, whatever. Yeah. This thing's got a vacuum seal at some point. No, because they're taking us to the fair. Not too puffed up yet, but it's on its way. We're gonna need to get beefcake out of here before she has her babies. Yeah. Mainly because when she has her baby, she basically gets all she can eat. All she can to eat and he would just gorge himself there's only one thing more you could do to make this better environment for animals and that's turn it into silvo pasture i'm trying to see can you see out we have silvo pasture out in there so we plan on doing that to this one acre into the month okay these guys are good but we need the lid we really do it'll clog up the right nip of water right up there all right how's their feed They look, they look happy and lazy right there. All the new sheep are still alive. And given their rear ends, I'm a little surprised to see solid poop. I'm happy to see solid poop. Look at this. This bank was crazy. What was, what was as crazy as that? Before sheep, after sheep. Hot dog. 
We're getting this cleared. So next, we're gonna go in here. And we're gonna go deeper into the woods, uh, down there at about where Sally is, and then start cutting up. Guys, you totally cleaned up the garden. Such good little underrated homestead animals. Incredible, incredible. Every little homestead ought to have two sheep. And you'll notice the sheep chores tend to be our most uneventful chores. Yeah. Meaning they're easy. I touch the fence unless it's off. Is he gonna make it? Nope. Just kidding, he has to I know. Okay. Sheep, 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 sheep. <laughs> Sheep, 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 sheep. Wow, they even eat that. What is that? It's not, it's, it's not blueberries. I know that. Looks a lot like it though, poisonous. so don't be fooled. Evidently it's not poisonous to the sheep, at least the leaves. Sheep! There they are. The tame ones went in. The wild ones are hanging tight. There they go, there they go. Big Daddy, I'm gonna have you feed these sheep a couple pans of alfalfa every day. And then, that way they'll start getting trained to that stuff. And if they get out, they'll come. For they're really having a good time. Love it, that's so satisfying right there. Only got about an hour until I need to leave to go back to the hospital. So, let's go. Look at you, Lily. You, you made everybody lunch? Mm -hmm. Okay, you heated up the rice, and look, heated up Lorraine's soup she made for us. Could we what? have left up watermelon? Sure. Well, eat, eat your lunch first. We eating out here today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's good, no flies this time of year. Yeah. There you go. Yum, 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 yum. How you doing, buddy? Just... Is this your surgery prep right here? Yeah, all this. All that. Goodness. Yeah, I see that. 20 minutes to surgery, you think I'll be on time? You got fair results there, Rebecca? Yeah. See, we can't go to the fair, Jonah. Dang. No, we can Jimmy go to the last place. Right. Um, it ends on the 18th. Who got, wait, how did Lily not win? What was it, her cake? Cake. Man, she did have a gluten-free. Do they taste it? Yes. Yeah, that might be why. Yeah. She's competing against gluten. We got no blue ribbons. Jonah did. I won the art art. Are there any chances for any surprises? Like you, you, you weren't able to put the joint back in because there was. I think so yeah. So I mean, this I was, one is more clean cut, you think? Yeah. What I was telling them earlier is that our hope is that just by pulling a little bit to open up the joint space, that we'll be able just to reach in there without having to pop the hip out of the socket again. With, with like pliers. Well, something kind of, sort of like, like Tweezers. Like, more like tweezers. Yeah, more like tweezers. Back. Oh, it feels so good out here. It does. I'm more nervous this time, though. Are you? Yeah, because of the complications last time, I reckon. He said, am I going, are you going to be mad if I want to ride dirt bikes again? And I can't, I'm not going to be mad. Am I going to hope that he doesn't wreck? Yes. Can I control him? No. I do want him to ride the dirt bike, even if it's just like on the road, very slow, just to get like... Getting some sun, you think the vitamins are out? I doubt the vitamins are out, but I just, it feels good on my legs. It feels good on my skin. But then I've been in a hospital room, like for days. We got a new room though, so that's exciting. Yeah. Are we gonna order something to eat? Yeah, we're gonna order burgers. Farm burger. Delivers. Food's here. He's been in about 30 minutes. What do you think, Beck? You got a good vibe? Yeah. Sucks. Some say it's gonna take two hours, some say three. Yeah. Beck, there they are. Dr. Hooker. Procedure. Procedure. This is good enough. This is it. The new apartment. I asked for this chair. <laughs> I like that chair. So this is a better view? This is a better view. Back outside. Good view. More waiting. Made it 
on the roof. Christy's coming to see us soon though. You guys remember Christy? Hi guys! Hi. How are you doing? Good. Yeah. It's so good to see you. Our babysitter from a long time ago, Great American Farm Tour days. We look like a couple of hobos out here laying on the concrete. Feels pretty good though, it's heated up from the sun. So we've been waiting an hour and a half and they just now called us saying they just started. Hey, Mrs. Warren in the operating room again. Hey. Um, the doctor requested I call you just because we're closing up. Okay. And uh, she thinks it will be at the point where you can see in about 45 minutes from now. Okay. Okay, great. And look who's here. Hey. <laughs> a nurse, a nurse in training. <laughs> That's the person to come. Aw. She just got the phone call that it's closed they're closing them up. them up. Okay, good. Yeah. So, so it went good. Only an hour. Then that's not bad. It comes up. That's not as. Yeah, that wasn't as bad as the first one, which is terrible. You got him some snacks. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> Don't love snacks, so yeah. bad too. <laughs> I snacks. was like, of all the times to bring you snacks, like more than a birthday, like you need snacks. <laughs> I know. I know. I will take those too. Yes. He will be so happy. That's perfect. This room again, Beck. <sighs> bad memories. This is where we. For all bad memories. In like four hours was it yesterday the day before i'm getting so confused it was yesterday very early morning but here's the two screws and the sockets up here right and i think when you compare that to the film we took today it's a little different because the magnification is different mm -hmm. but what you see is if you look at this gap between here and here mm -hmm. it's wider yeah, and it the is. gap is now. Mm -hmm. This is the one after we got tonight. it. Tonight? Yeah, tonight okay. after we got it out. So there's a cartilage in the knee that sits between the joints. There's a similar one in the hip. It's called the labrum. Most people haven't heard of it. It's like <laughs> a kind of not well known. Right. No, so I kind of talk about the meniscus because people have heard of that. But it's very similar. It sits in there. And it turns out that is what was flipped in the joint. Exactly. Oh, wow. Exactly. So what had happened was... And this may be why he had so much pain. It may be. Exactly. Yeah. So wow. the socket... Plus is hard. I know. It's beautiful. What do you mean flipped in the joint? That's what I'm getting ready to describe. So the socket, you know, if it kind of sits like this, uh -huh. the labrum normally is a circular thing that kind of goes all the way around the edge of it. Okay. And what had happened was it tore off from the back part of the hip socket. Uh -huh folded itself in oh. and then the hip was actually sitting in it the ball was sitting on top of a basically a double layer of labrum where it had folded in there so what we had to do was actually dislocate it again okay. and then flip this piece out so now it's instead of being kind of folded up like that yeah. now it's so it wasn't bone fragments out. or were it they has, bone fragments it has a fragment attached to it where it tore off from the back of the pelvis oh wow so when it peeled off from the back of the pelvis it, it took, took a this bone sliver of yeah. bone with it but it was the sliver that we were seeing on the ct on scan on the ct scan that's right wow. yep and it was attached to this label so now it's so he's going to feel better i think he should Up. I got pictures. What did you say? Oh, well, he's sleeping, and that's a good thing. It's 10 o'clock. We're gonna all go to bed. Thank you for following along on this journey, and your well wishes and prayers. Thank you, thank you, thank you.